When creating a website, we sometimes get stuck with the default functionality of our post types. And a way to extend that is with WordPress custom fields. In simple terms, custom fields add extra information to your posts, pages, and custom post types. And actually, most WordPress plugins that give you extra functionality rely on custom fields. WooCommerce, for example, all product information like price, title, product ID is a set of custom fields. If you want a bit more technical explanation, WordPress custom fields are additional information that is stored as metadata. If you're ready to try this out for yourself, let me show you how to add custom fields in WordPress. The first step is to enable custom fields as it isn't by default. If you're using the WordPress Classic Editor, you can do that in the screen options for any post type. I've got a post here already open. So let's open the screen options here at the top and check the custom field box. And if you're using the Gutenberg Editor, same thing, let's open a post or any post type. And here you'll have to click on these three dots here and open options. Same thing as before, just check the box with the custom fields. And now in both in the Gutenberg editor and the classic editor, that opened the custom fields meta box here right at the bottom. Now just click on enter new and we can start filling it in. So let's say we have a travel page and we're selling travel packages and we want to categorize them by travel type, like adventure, for example, extreme or stuff like that. Keeping that in mind, the name could be type, as in type of travel, and then the value. Let's start with adventure, for example. To add it, click on add custom field. At this point, you would create custom fields for all categories. So the same name, but different values, like adventure, extreme, cruise, whatever you wish. Remember, it will be used across all of your posts. Now that we have our custom fields created, let's put them to good use. There are a couple of ways to display them, but this one you'll need to have some coding knowledge. I won't go deep into the coding side at all, but I think you should know. If you want to display all of your custom fields, you can use the meta function. If you want to display a specific custom field, you can use the cat post meta, where you can specify the key of the custom field you want to display. But in WordPress, there's always a way to avoid coding. And in this situation, it's the Advanced Custom Fields plugin. And you can download it straight from the admin panel. I have the plugin downloaded and activated already. What's special about this plugin is that it not only allows you to skip coding, but it also allows to display multiple types of information types, like images, date picker, color picker, and many more. So I have recreated the custom fields that we created before. And uh, as you can see, I have a field group here already with the travel packages and it contains three custom fields, the types that we talked about before. As you can see, there are a lot of parameters you can adjust, but I've created the most simple custom fields just with the type. So now that I've created my custom fields, I'll be able to give value to them. So. I'm going to do that in this post named travel. As you can see, we have our types here and I've got adventure, cruise and extreme. All right. If you're working with Visual Composer, there's a premium compatibility element available for advanced custom fields. So let me show you how you can get your hands on that. First, open any post and go to the hub. Now look for advanced custom fields and download the elements if you haven't already. I have it downloaded already, but let me show you where I'm going to add it. I've got a beautiful travel page here with a couple of uh, travel packages and I would love to give some categories here at the bottom. So let's add the advanced custom field element here and that opens the edit window. So now we just have to write down the title of the post. Do you remember it was the travel post where the element is going to get information from? 
and the field name. Let's start with type one. As you can see, that's adventure. And of course you can continue doing that for the rest as well. Of course, it's the same host here and and type three was extreme. So now we've got an extreme trip to Italy. It's that simple, everyone. WordPress custom field is a very powerful feature that can make content editing a lot easier. So thank you all for watching and enjoy.